the, when a woman is good, she's really good. No so doubt. Much. And when 100%. a woman is bad, she's, she's really, really bad. bad. So, 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 <laughs> would you then agree with me that yeah. no, um, no matter how successful you are, yeah. when you have a good woman, she enhances your level yeah, of success. No doubt. It's she not takes just, you beyond. It's not just enhances. Amplifies. She amplifies. She she quadruples. Yeah. again on another cooking episode on your favorite podcast in the whole wide world is the fnf catchy dialogues guys yeah, man. today we are talking about whether you agree that mm-hmm. behind every successful man is always a woman mm-hmm. what are your thoughts because that's what we know behind every successful yeah, man when you become it, successful see, on your own accord needs to it, say it, that see, behind me, every successful but, man but, but, but it's just a quote said, it's just a quote. You don't yeah. agree. Oh, I've, I've but let's take it as a quote for now. Okay. Yeah. All right. For me, I think this this particular quote or statement, whatever it is, is applicable in just about fifteen percent of men, and in the case those who are married. Yeah. yeah. Really? Apart from those who are married. Are you sure? I, I mean, it applies to about fifteen percent of single people. Yeah. But particularly yeah, to about married. those who are married. In my opinion. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Because how many single men would you attribute that, okay, yes, this guy is successful because, because of this woman? This woman. Yeah. It's just a few. Because, you and know, you're, guys you're are... one of the few. Because <laughs> <laughs> you, know, <laughs> you know that guys, naturally, mm-hmm. you know, we yeah, are forceful. inclined to yeah. try to work, work hard. hard. Yeah. yeah. So, personally, I am of the opinion that if I haven't reached a certain status or a certain yeah. level... I'm not even thinking of marriage. Okay. Do you get it? Because I want to make a certain kind of provision for my family. Yeah. And if I rush into it right now, you know, it's just one of those That's things. True. So, yeah. yeah, when I get there, no woman can say that, oh, I made you there and then. If we marry and we are going forward, you definitely contribute to my success. Yeah. yeah. But yeah. it's not always yeah. the case. I think, I think for most women are actually blessings to men. Oh yeah, like yeah, women, women, are, born women that way. are women in general are blessings to special men. Creation. Yeah. Special creation, yeah, yeah, yeah. but benefit you know, a lot from you, them. Yeah, you get more of that blessing when you marry that lady. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah because yeah. she gives you her all in all. Sometimes it's not about her working to like, support you financially. Sometimes it's the but prayers. So when she gives you that peace of mind, mind at home yeah, to yeah, think, yeah. Yeah. there are women who have very great business ideas. Yeah, yeah. There are men who come home. During the middle of the night, they wake up and they are brainstorming. So you come back from work. You don't discuss anything about work. You find something to eat. Maybe you watch something to cool down. You go to sleep. Then at 3 a.m., everybody's awake. It just happens automatically. Then you are reflecting how was work and then going into the future. And there are some decisions that your wife will tell you, I think don't do this. Or you want to go for a business venture? She tells you, "Okay, I can help in this regard. I can speak to this person, and right. it works like magic." See, yeah, women, yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 But, but see, women, we are not. Hmm, we should just need to get a time and talk about women. Yeah, just appreciate women. Some like, women, some women. Like, yeah, yeah we the just very good time. ones. The very good ones. We should just need. To, when a woman is good, she's really good. No she's doubt. Good. And when 100%. a woman is bad, she's, she's really, really bad. bad. So, 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 <laughs> would you then agree with me that? Yeah. No. Um. No matter how successful you are, yeah. when you have a good woman, she enhances your level yeah, of success. No doubt, it's she not takes just, you beyond. It's not just enhances, amplifies. She amplifies. She she quadruples. Yeah, I understand. Yeah, it, it, no it's doubt. Crazy because, like you rightly said, and like you also submitted, if you have a very good woman, one who prays for you, you see, if if you have a very good woman, yeah, what they do is they acknowledge their role as a helper in your yeah, life. Yeah. So they tend to sit back and, and watch you. Okay. They'll be like, okay, you're doing this. Yeah, thing. Fifi, I'm not I'm not trying to ha- I'm not <laughs> yeah. trying to ha- you, eh? Yeah. But you see, yesterday, last night, you said something when you were watching Stone Boy and the wife. Right. Yeah. You made a very good call. You made a comment. Yeah. yeah. You see, I made a very good call. Yeah. She like, allows him to be Stone Boy out there. Yeah. Okay. And becomes a father. And inside. I'm pretty sure exactly. And I'm pretty yeah. sure when he comes back home. He's, uh, she's able to, you know, give an input yeah, like yeah. this. Because for some time now, you could see 
Stoneboy always attributes his success yeah, to the to wife. The wife. Yeah. Yeah. Knowing he was doing well, but the wife has helped exactly. him to yeah. Yeah. a very good extent. Yeah, Because yeah. 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 when you don't have that peace of mind at home and you have some ladies that are not assertive, they are, they are trouble. And you know and what then, you get it. One yeah, of the things is, well, let's link this particular topic to the DNA. Imagine you have a woman who you have, both of you have done things like moved on and she betrays you in the DNA aspect. You know, it can break it you can down. Shatter you. Exactly. So you understand? So that's a, it's, a, it's a very controversial topic we are discussing. I, I, I always say to every woman I meet or when I get the opportunity to speak to her, I make sure I establish that women are so powerful. Yeah, yeah. So powerful that if, if one woman is able to fully live the potential of her powers. Whoever is associated with that woman is blessed. Yes, yeah, yeah, yeah. If she decides to go the bad way and is able to fully utilize her Nicole. evil powers, oh, you are, you are dead. <laughs> if she decides to use the yeah, good power, you, you are set for life. So you could see most you successful men, eh, they sometimes attribute their success to their mother, who is basically a woman. Yeah. Like, yeah. Women sacrifice a you lot. You see, for women... For, for most responsible, successful men, they never relegate the efforts of, of their, wife. their wife. No Absolutely. matter how they, they, their income or their level of... Yeah, their income. Because when you marry, their success is for both of you. But no matter how personally their income or the level of position they, they get in their career or their personal lives go, they always attribute the biggest factor no, but, to, but, to but, 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 but I just thought about something. You know, most successful men too, they are divorced. A, a lot. <laughs> so, sometimes, <laughs> what I've seen is that yeah. sometimes there's disagreement yeah. with because, regards to a few, me, a few things with yeah. regards to, let's say the woman is as successful as the man. You know, and they are thinking of how to go ahead with investment. If the woman has her own mindset, or it gets to a point where she she thinks that we are not agreeing, oh. or both of you are equally striving for that success. Sometimes, the, the woman interest. wants to be independent. Yeah. The man yeah. feels that he needs to concentrate on job. You don't get time for each other. So yeah, most successful men, people. What what successful what brings what what I brings know, you that can talk is about that? Can you wears more like half uh, yeah, yeah. Wears everybody must, wants to be independent. The man yeah. the um, man is concentrated what's, what's on so Amazon many things that name? are not related to family. What's this Amazon guy's name? Oh. Jeff Bezos. Yeah, he's also divorced. Yeah. No, Jeff Bezos is. Um, yeah, yeah, that's yeah, him. Yeah, 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 he's also yeah, divorced. Yeah. So look, look at the trend. Donald and Trump. It, Trump to his divorce. Yeah, and you you wonder, but I think you know. For I, most I think of those it's people. They we, are we, more centered on career. You know when that exactly. In as much as your wife is successful, uh, um, helping you to become successful at your job, you don't negate that family responsibility yeah, responsibility exactly, yeah. so yeah. for most of those people is that oh no for that uh, we can't, we can't being irresponsible no, we, can't, we can't sit here and as say a family they were, man maybe they were we can't sit here and say that yeah so the thing is we are not relegating it to the, the sex um the, the contribution that women make to men being successful and i also will stand by the point that it is not always the case, the case yes, of, yeah. where the woman has made the man successful, successful. okay yeah. one other point that is worth noting is it might not be immediately visible to yeah. you the man mm. as to how influential your wife or your girlfriend or your fiance yeah. is being into your success mm. okay because there are stories where people have got jobs but it's their wives who or their yeah. girlfriends who went behind the scenes to, get to make some, some recommendations and yeah, other things yeah. for that to happen or the women are praying yeah, for yeah. them in some, some corner yeah, other yeah. Thing. Yeah. so it might not be immediately obvious because no matter how successful but wait, you are. Do, would you like to have share an experience did you like with your past relationship or your relationship you feel your woman yep. is part of your success yeah absolutely you see i i am of the opinion that in every relationship i've been in the woman has made me better yeah right? okay people you meet different people and the different people you meet right. come with different yeah. qualities all right. All right. okay mm. and you tend to if you're in a relationship with um in one of my past relationships it's that relationship that made me very punctual yeah. Because if that lady says we are meeting at seven you and you come at seven one, you won't meet her, and she will leave you a text before seven one for you to know that she was there yeah, at seven, seven and you weren't. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Do you get it? Yeah. And then there are other things that you pick. Yeah. So all of these things 
they shape you. Yeah. It might not be immediately obvious. Yeah. As as I sit here, I can say that oh, I wrote my exam, the, I did this, and I came to the UK. But respecting time, okay, what? being able to set a target for yourself. Yeah. These are bits that you picked from, from people. people. It yeah. might not be immediately obvious how True. influential yeah. they've yeah. been, mm-hmm. but if you sit down and reflect, that's why reflection is very important. True. You sit down and reflect. You know that. Ah, that girl that girl, girl. yeah that, that because, woman because we had we had, we had that it? for me personally I, I have one woman yeah one like I feel like, like one woman who I feel made me who I am like yeah she contributed she massively she contributed massively yeah yeah great so for my in my situation yeah. right there are so many decisions had it not been for my wife I wouldn't have taken yeah. And I think it's helped me so much, especially with regards to finances, right? It's like we agree on a lot of things, and sometimes before I'll think it, she had also thought about it. So when I start talking, she says, "Yeah, I've also thought about it. Let's let's do it this way." And sometimes I'm thinking about a thing. I want to do something. I'm so worried about it. Like how how do I get it? How do I make it? And then she gives you a certain a certain level of calmness that. Oh, I think when we do it this way, you find a lot of sense in it. Something you wouldn't have thought about. She has that solution for you, right? And also, coming over to the UK, but she was the one that pushed me. She won't let you rest if she knows that this thing I know you can get it. Yeah. This thing I know that you are good for it. Even if you know the times that I I doubt myself, she lets me know that. I can, I sh- yeah, I can do it. Yeah, exactly. Mm-hmm. So she put a lot of pressure on me to write that exam. She said, "Yeah, I've written, but I know that when you write, you do much better. So go for it." Yeah. I absolutely. I I prepared very little, but then when when I I, I sat for that exam, that was it. So, so success had it not been her, I would have yeah. been postponing, yeah. procrastinating. Yeah. And yeah. Then let's not relegate the fact that there are some men who also make women, women. oh yeah yeah yeah, yeah, yeah. Nobody, see, today yeah. let's focus on women for now yeah. maybe another day we'll talk about men yeah. <laughs> but today let's yeah. try and Ma- appreciate men, yeah men some, really, some men, women, some men yeah. also um, some women also attribute their success to men very well v- very, uh, little. very little very little hardly very, very would little. hardly when would a woman you hear is successful they would hardly they tell you that it's my husband yeah, yeah they'll be like i did it in yeah. this in this current generation where we have these feminists and yeah. all of these women advocates striving for equality and all things it's very nasty out there yes. okay. even, even if you you set up that business for her she becomes successful she hardly just 0.1% yeah. will mention that oh it was this one especially yeah. if you are not married to her if you are married to her then people can relate that oh yeah. your husband is successful yeah, so yeah. yeah. And, yeah. And, and we and, knew and where you were coming from yeah. before you yeah. got there but if boyfriend and the, the woman can equally make you very unsuccessful very 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 very, very 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 the woman can unsuccessful. bring you down See, like if you have if, a woman who is after flashy things and <laughs> all that which is the case these days and they have the mentality that you're supposed to provide for them yeah. and all that you find some there are examples of people we know who are yeah. you know just throwing the, tennis, the money. The tennis. Of, said, uh, this a lady told me she said a woman's money is her own money, but a man's money is for, is for he and, and the, the woman. woman. That is another <laughs> discussion for another. You see, yeah. this I feel like all these ideologies about relationships and opinions that people have formed have come from movies have come from yeah storybooks too many and telenovelas you see, too much telenovelas because if if you are with the majority of say say in ghana with majority of people being christians if you're actually going into the bible and look at the standards that have been set you won't be thinking that i mean take uk for instance how do you say that your money is your money and your husband's money is for the whole house nisika is saying look at the rent that is coming yeah. in the month yeah. if you decide to keep your money to yourself do you get it so then you the man you are forced to go the extra mile you have to no matter you will you, die you, and leave the property yeah so you you have to like it's society and i don't know that is how god made it the man is supposed to be a provider right yeah but in some situations and circumstances no matter how much you try as a man your wife can be more successful For than you are. no yeah. matter how hard you try yeah i've seen i've uh, we had this um pastor so our, the, our pastor's wife the woman is very successful she 
she supports the ministry like mad, but she she's still being successful. Like she can't stop being successful. And no matter how hard the husband tries, he can never be as successful as unless yeah, God just, wants to change happens. situations. So and yeah, see, and the, the one comes then the, the she doesn't complain. She she just knows that yeah, I have yeah. to. She appreciates your effort. Yeah. So sometimes I have the problem where men feel there are some men, right? Who are threatened. Yes. <laughs> Their are ego makes them... Yeah, yeah. About yeah. Their and wife's even success, sometimes yeah. they end up divorcing the women. Like, yeah. they, they feel so bad yeah. that their women are more successful than they are and they feel irresponsible. But that is actually a credit to you that you're yeah. changing that narrative. Now from behind every successful man, there's yeah. a woman to now behind a successful woman, there's you the man. Because you definitely support her goals. You definitely push her to get better and all of those things. Yeah. So it's a credit. If you're a man and your woman is doing better than you, you shouldn't. That shouldn't lower your self-esteem. That should actually give you a boost. Yeah, yeah. you get it. Oh, that is the more, CEO's yeah. husband. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, he's a carpenter. I'm not a carpenter. My wife is a CEO. Yeah. Or she's dead. Do you mm. get it? But you see, but most you see, men. You see, yeah. what I'm most most okay. Some men feel belittle when their wives exactly yeah some yeah. men feel it, it can't always be the case that you as the man the woman will live in your yeah, shadows forever yeah, no. if if that's the kind of man you are then you should have a rethink yeah, you should, you should pull you should your pull, woman you see, along with you see you. i feel i believe men should be always be pulling people you yeah. can't always be start, you can't you always stand on top. Top. you know, do you no. know um today's generation where lots of men young guys Gen Z's and some millennials have showed ladies pepper. There are ladies who have actually sponsored men through yeah. school and yeah. then the, en- the men end up showing them. Then there's equally the men who men, have sponsored yeah, women. Yeah, yeah, and, yeah. But, but it's very painful where no matter where you are, whether in the UK, the US, Asia, w- whatever continent you are, a man has been created to be a provider. Yeah. A woman is a, someone who is born to okay. or made up to support you. Yeah. right she can be, uh, do majority of the work but she's to be a supporter but if the one who is supposed to support you actually provides for you and then you're ungrateful to her it's very painful but you see one of the it's things is painful. ungratefulness that is why is, ladies is are so res- some ladies are reserved they are being careful off i won't support you people. you travel outside and go and marry yeah, another you woman yes, you yes, understand yeah. 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 but one of the things is you see you need to cut ungrateful people off before you you know before you would have realized the person is yeah, so grateful you are so much invested yeah, yeah. you've, you've invested yeah, so much and it's very painful yeah so i think um every everybody like ladies we won't say because of bad experiences you should stop supporting your men no, you Just should you should try maybe you have to limit it till you are well married like you are married before you you, you shouldn't go be to all, a certain no, level you shouldn't, of, you shouldn't always no you can't support the person with ideas yeah. but if it's resources with, you with can support scanty, somebody yeah, resources. with resources yeah. yeah but it depends you, know, you, no, you, you see basically you know the person you dating are dating is tricky exactly dating is tricky dating is not a sure bet that you're going to marry I think so that's don't the don't line. don't give something you can't afford to lose bro you give you see you know the person you, you are with yeah you know the person you are with you know the person you are if that person is the right one, so you know you don't mind the right going one all out. If you know fails, the people who fails. we knew they were like uh, our our own right. uh, <laughs> brothers <laughs> who have showed ladies who trusted them so much. Yeah. You, this guy is very innocent. Yeah. He looks like an angel. He can kiss your feet and d- be sleeping with your friend. Mar- it, bro, would it, be marrying your friend the next day, but you wouldn't know. Bro, you would have... If if it comes to other people's relationships, so you do that I at your ever say a word oh but for because me because you never really know the story see, for me personally really i, ne- I, I never, never condemn any guy in a relationship regardless of what a guy does see let's you know why uh, why say you that's have, a lesson i never condemn any guy in a relationship mm-hmm. regardless of what a guy does mm-hmm. why we'll talk about it the next time okay so <laughs> <laughs> any last words guys yeah so um like you don't agree totally that behind every successful man no is that, a woman. that i don't some men have made yeah. their own success but yeah. i'm not relegating the fact that there could be a woman in the background yeah. men primarily is usually your mother praying for, for you, you or something like that alternatively men shouldn't also assume that because the women are not 
giving out or providing material resource it doesn't mean that they are not doing anything they are doing things yeah. in the background praying for you making sure you have peace of mind to think even peace of mind getting even getting peace, peace of mind, of mind is, is very it's expensive. a very scarce resource very expensive yeah resource. so if you get it in, yeah. in someone that is all we need ladies that's appreciate. respect yeah. we, we don't need too much love just the respect and that peace of mind Charlie. Yeah. our heart is for you yeah so Thanks for staying with us. Yep. Ladies, put your thoughts in the comment section. We will actually love to get a lady on the part two of this particular discussion. Yeah. We'll, 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 we'll have a part two of this. Uh, share, tell someone about FNF Catchy Dialogues. And until we meet in the next episode, it's peace.